Welcome to The Update, Soul Therapy's weekly news on Korean hip-hop and r and I'm your host, Liz. Before we dive into the video, to stay up to date with all our future K-hip-hop content, hit the subscribe button and the bell for notifications so you don't miss out. Tickets are still available for yu gi concerts with us in Paris and London this May, so be sure to head to the link in our bio so you don't miss out. Please be advised that the following news contains discussions of the difficult topic of child that some viewers may find distressing and should watch with caution. Or skip to this time code to avoid it. This week, reports emerged of an unnamed high school rapper contestant being charged with child Earlier this week, it had been revealed by an official source that the rapper in question is high school rapper One's Ocean Gum, who had previously been treated for mental health issues due to him acting irrationally. His first indictment is for sexual of a nine-year-old boy. His lawyer argued that his actions were qualitatively different from assault and that Gum had apologised to the victim's family. For further information, visit our website where we talk about the case in detail. You can find the link below in the info box. Less than a week after Highlight Records dissolved, Be Free, who is a former artist of the label, released a diss track against Palo Alto and the label titled Elon Musk. Palo Alto responded in the SoundCloud comments with, All right, continue to use me for money. Palo Alto then took to Instagram to make it clear that he won't be responding with a diss track of his own. And he said that Be Free justified his problems by blaming them on him and that he doesn't think suing would stop him. Among the questions about Be Free, fans also asked Palo Alto if he would be joining another label or starting his own after Highlight closing. He said that he has no plans of setting up another label, but his answer about signing to an existing one was a more vague, let's see about that. He also assured fans that while Highlight closed its doors, it doesn't mean that he and Huckleberry P are no longer friends, as the two have made music as a duo in the past. Netflix Korea confirmed that production of the upcoming movie Ballerina is underway, and among the cast announcement revealed that Grey will be the music director. Swings took to Instagram to share what happened when he lost his wallet this week. He left it at a cafe and when he called, the staff said that they would hold on to it for him. However, later that day he got a call from his card company informing him that somebody had spent over £2,000 on Farfetch London's online store. This has been The Update. Don't forget to like, share and comment telling us what you thought about this week's news. I'll see you next week.